So these masks, you can buy this, 2,000 of these masks on Amazon for 149 bucks. Ends up being seven and a half cents a mask, right? I cannot tell you how many businesses I go to where I forgot a mask. And I'm, I'm, I'm famous for losing masks. I'm forgetting about them, right? I got masks all over the place and I'm going, my mind's out. I'm like, I forgot my mask. Sorry, you can't come in. If I had to tell you how many businesses turned me away because I did not have a mask, I couldn't even tell you. And by the way, this is not a political message. I ask, do you have one of the blue masks to give me? Sorry, we don't have it. Like, let me get this straight. Seven and a half cents cost you a hundred, two hundred, a thousand, five thousand dollar customer and referrals of other people for me to send to you just because you didn't get a couple hundred masks to give your front desk to say, don't worry, give it to them. Yesterday, I went to a spa and I, after the spa, I was at O, o Spa in uh, Manalapan, I believe. After the spa, I went to the Apple store. When I went to the Apple store to buy some ear pods, right? Cause I, the, you know, these are famous for losing these, but I like these more than the ear pod pro. And uh, the girl's like, okay, thank you. Went into the Apple store. I like to order this. She took my credit card. She wiped my credit card. The machine she used, she wiped the machine. She wiped her hands. She put the card in. After she put the card in, she gave me the pen to sign. Each pen they used, they throw it away. Then she wiped the card again and handed it to me to, with a wipe. I'm like, do you guys do this? Yes, we do. You've been trained on this? Yes. Like, what a special touch. And when I walked in, do you need a mask? We have a mask. Of course, you're not going to lose a $149 customer. What's the profit margins on this, you think, for Apple? 90 bucks, 100 bucks. What do you think this costs to make at the amount of that? So again, sometimes people have to realize it's not about politics. This is about you running a business. And one of the things we definitely cannot afford to do is having more small businesses go out of business. Small business owners, entrepreneurs go invest in these masks. I'm not, I don't disagree. I'm not talking to whether you agree with it or not. This is something where somebody comes in. The last thing you want to lose a business for is this seven and a half cents. Go buy a couple thousand of these. I don't get any kind of advantages or Amazon doesn't send me money for this. Go buy it on your own. Get a couple thousand of them. When customers come in, if they don't have it, get one of those tongs. Okay. The tongue, you get it. Here you go, hand it to them, great. Customer comes in, shows responsibilities, you get more business. As, as much as this sounds common sense, as much as this sounds common sense, you would be amazed how many people don't use this aspect of common sense with their business today. If I'm, on, if I'm the only one doing, going through this, then don't worry about it. If you say, Pat, I've gone through this as well, smash that thumbs up button. If you say, Pat, I haven't experienced any of this, smash the thumbs down button, and I'm okay with that. But uh, yeah, so get some of these masks. Don't say no to your customers. Allow the customers to come in. Having said that, if you enjoyed this video, I also want you to watch a video called 10 Reasons Why Companies Go Out of Business. If you've not watched this video, it's probably one of the most detailed videos I've ever done. If you've not watched it, click over to watch a video. 10 Reasons Why Companies, Small Businesses, Entrepreneurs Go Out of Business. Having said that, have a great week, everybody. Take care. Bye-bye.